And now to a developing story. Several people are taken to the hospital after a shooting outside the National Security Agency at Fort Meade. But none of the injuries was caused by the gunfire. It all began when a vehicle tried to enter the agency's secure grounds without authorization. CBS 4's Ouija Jang has the latest developments live from Maryland. Ouija? Well, Elliot, law enforcement sources tell us that the Maryland State Police was actually chasing that vehicle when it took the exit for the NSA and then crashed. After that, for a reason still unknown, an NSA officer fired shots. Several bullets pierced the windshield of a black SUV outside the headquarters of the National Security Agency. Law enforcement sources tell CBS News the driver of the vehicle tried to drive through a security gate at an entrance to the campus Wednesday morning, located on the Fort Meade campus. Sources tell CBS News shots were fired, but no one was hit. Three people in the vehicle were hurt in the crash, which caused the airbags to deploy. Several people were taken to the hospital. The the NSA released a statement saying the situation is under control and there is no ongoing security or safety threat. Investigators from the FBI, NSA and local police are all on the scene, which is just beyond this parking lot that is also a staging area for the media. The incident is reminiscent of a deadly shooting in March 2015 when the NSA opened fire on another SUV that tried to ram the gate, killing the driver and wounding the passenger. The White House says the president has been briefed on today's situation. And three people who were inside the vehicle are now in police custody, although we still don't know why those police officers were tailing them in the first place. The FBI is now leading the investigation. Elliot, back to you.